Master Geralt. A guard spotted you from the tar. They sent me to open the gate. Why was it closed? Is that famous Skellige hospitality? Me? Tis tradition. After the feast, the Jarls will choose the king, so the doors must remain closed. Only the sons and daughters of Skellige may stay in the castle. Sounds kind of presumptuous. Crack made an, an exception for me? Maybe we won't say that. So maybe I ought to stop by another time. All know what you did for Ceres and Yalmar. Today, you're one of us. Hey. Um, crack awaits. My current. How's the mood in there? Ooh, calm. They're talking. Too calm. How's that? We've an adage here at Skellige. At a good feast, meat and blood flow in equal measure. Surely you consider this barbaric on the continent, no? Not sure. Sounds preferable to dull banquets garnished with court intrigue. True. So I, I'm reporting to Croc to collect the reward from him right, because I finished I helping her and Yalmar. Not pinch my allies. If an aunt crates to wear the crown, it should be you, because you've got fur growing on your chin, that it. Show some of your own, and the Jarls just might listen to you. Don't your mug smacked? Remember, I was left standing last time we crossed fists. <laughs> yeah? So you'll fight the Vilkards with me? Wonder who'll do better? You? Or Yalmar, the giant slayer? Oh, stop your shit! Yalmar, shit you barely did anything in that fight. Cyrus! Hey! God damn it! See, Krak. He talking to the Jarls? No, went to his chambers. To prepare your promised reward, no doubt. If you'd a spell witch, or perhaps you'd fancy some fisticuffs with the Vilkarls. Loosen up your joints after your journey. Maybe later. Well, and just a reminder, um, I guess I need to say this more than a couple of times. Otherwise, people get sassy with me on YouTube. Um, I'm skipping most of the white dialogue because this is not my first playthrough. I've seen all of the white dialogue in the past, and it just takes a while. So, if you really want me to go through the white dialogue, I will. But for the most part, I don't think people care if I skip it. If it was my first playthrough, then you, you don't want to skip it, but it's not. Greetings, Berna. Feast not to your liking. This is no feast. It's a farmer's market where votes are bought and sold like sheepskins. Leaving Kertrolda? Tomorrow at daybreak. Enjoy yourself, Master Geralt. Some of the white dialogue is so good that I don't want to skip it, but for the most part, May I? it just makes the you must whole even part take a lot come. longer. I've been waiting for you. So, feast to your liking. Any better than your continental balls? Definitely more to drink. Ah, there is. Rolled all of it out of my cellars. Double meads, triple, Cintrian plum brandy, a hackamum spirit that burns a mouth like boiling water. Clan on Crate knows the meaning of hospitality. Promised me a reward for helping your children. And I aim to keep my word. Here. This bauble's been in the family for generations. I give it to you for helping ensure the line endures. Beautiful craftsmanship. Thanks. I'm the one. Wait, we had something else to say. Might have been one or the other. That's not Yalmar. Let's go. I get to choose between Saris and Yalmar. That would hurt. That would hurt pretty bad. Show me what you got. He's dead. Oh, he sent me flying. Oh, 
Are there more? Oh. Looks like it. Ooh, thought he was down. Ooh, put that candle out. It's important. Hey, Rakas. Some cloth! Gotta stop the bleeding! Uh, Quick! Da. Uh, da. Take my cloak. Uh, Hold on, sir. You'll pull through. A shark grabbed my leg once. Albion! He's dead. Uh, Crack! Where'd those bears come from, huh? Answer! Now! Careful how you speak to my dad. Stow your blade, pup, or Crack will lose a son too. You insult me, Lugas, and now you threaten my son. I will not step to this. Dad, come here. Come on! Put you down like a rabbit dog. Calm Ooh. down. Calm down. Enough blood's been spilt. Someone brought these beasts here to murder our sons and brothers. We cannot restore their lives, but we can, we must avenge them. This burden falls upon the host and his offspring. Find the guilty on crate, find and kill them, else your clan will be cursed for a hundred generations to come. Anybody see how the bears got in? Don't matter. I know where to find the guilty already. Wait? Are you mad? You're gonna kill folk before we've learned what happened. Learn all you want. Meantime, I'll go wash the shame off our clan. Hey, the Yards aren't listening anymore. Stop playing the hero and think for a second. Our honor's at stake, sis. I can't wait. Are you listening to me? Someone let those bears in. We must know who, and the answer lies somewhere in this room. Choosing Ceres. I, I just, I like the quest better. And I think she honestly would just make a better ruler than Yalmar, because she's trying to be level-headed here and like, oh, let's figure out what happened before we just go cracking skulls. And he's like, no, let's go crack some skulls. Like, he just seems impulsive. Um, I've done both before. I like the Ceres one better. You're right, Ceres. I'll help you. Thanks. Fine. See you when I return with the traitor's heads. I'll stay here. Someone must see to everything. Summon the healer, hand the fallen over to their families. Wolf, I thank you. You're welcome. I've been good. My time with my family was a lot of fun. That. No, and I hope I never will again. My time off Where from work was nice. Fun? All laughing, eating, drinking. Suddenly, a massacre. Torrents of blood on the walls. Maybe it, like, I mean, if it's white dialogue, I don't think you have to ask. I just want to see what she says to this. What happened before the massacre? Be precise. Y young Lucas bet he could empty a barrel of beer in one go. He climbed on the table, grabbed a pony keg of centrin wheat, and started chugging. His throat bulged like a blowfish. Face went red, but he kept drinking. Folks started banging their tankers on the table, shouted, Lugos, Lugos. Then, from the other side of the room, we heard this roar. We turned in unison as if a coxswain had called. They were there. They were already there. Folks closest to the bears didn't even manage to draw their weapons. They... They were ripped to shreds. We'll avenge them, I promise. We've talked enough. Let's look around. Let me know what you find. I'll speak to the others. Maybe someone saw more than I did. Now back to grim reality. Yeah. Starting work this morning. Getting out of bed this... 
Hey, Getting out of bed this morning was hard, no. knowing I had to work all day. The gates were shut. Fang marks, claw marks, broken bones. Hard to say what exactly killed him. It's like looking forward to the vacation is almost better than the vacation because the vacation goes by so fast. Audric. Shit, no more than a kid. Ooh. All right. What do we have here? Bear's Examine head, the gonads. The short, like a human's. Mouth smells of honey liqueur. Mead. And something else. Something earthy. Bears like honey. Before it's fermented. Strange. Do I really have to work? I know, sometimes I think... Can't they just fire me and give me severance, then I can collect unemployment? <laughs> but then I think, no, I need the income. I need I need a roof over my head. The unemployment would probably be so low. Something under the fur. A tattoo. Shape of a bear paw. I need a roof over my head. I need to eat. Old scar. Looks like it was sutured. Half man, half bear. Berserker. Something like a lycanthrope. No full moon, so something else caused the transformation. Maybe something he ate or drank. Mead. Mead with an earthy aroma. Need to check the horns, tankards, and bowls. Okay. Examine the traces of mead around the crime scene using your witcher senses. There's a horn? All the horns are empty. Okay. Oh, Yamar, you're still here. Can we talk to him? Just curious to see. Uh huh. No. Earthy scent from the bear's maw. Something towards mushrooms. Bowls empty wounds. The scents in the no air. Yalborn cut to death. Somewhere else in this room. Bowl at each table. Mead in this one. And only mead. I'm supposed to follow the scent, but there's other red glowies to Drogadar. examine. Scald's played his last. I don't want to skip them, just just in case. Probably good to skip them at this point. But I already examined that other bear. Young Lugos. Bears took him by surprise. Didn't have a chance to defend himself. Okay. That appears to be everything that we can follow the scent. Nope, Ben's here. Yeah. Here. Mead spiked with some kind of mushroom. And... human blood. Shrooms. Ceres, come here. A guard saw what happened. Those weren't bears. They were- Men who transform into bears. Uh-huh. Berserkers. Think I know what caused them to transform. The mead they drank. Smell this. Mead spiked with blood. And something else. Thinking it could be a mushroom, but I don't recognize the type. Sure, it might help us. Few druids know herbs better. Can't hurt to try. Ask York to have a look at the mead sample. Okay, oh, Saris. Wait for me, Saris! She really wants that answer. She's not willing to wait for me. Okay, now she's slowing down. Oh. Hey, York. Freya, our mother. May the sea swallow the traitors. Freya, our lady. Mind if I interrupt? Already have? What is it? Someone Good spiked point. one of the mead barrels with blood and something else. An herb or a mushroom. Sarah said. Give me the horn. I know the smell. A mushroom. Mardrom. Let's see what he says to Mardrum this. Mardrom related in any way to berserkers? Aye. But only in the tales told to children as they are put to sleep on cold winter nights. 
Warriors who ate marjoram were said to transform into beasts when consumed by battle rage. But as I said, it's only battle only a rage. legend I know. Still, I find it easier to believe than some story about bears appearing out of nowhere. Mardrum. Never heard of it. You have another name for it on the continent. Silas Aib, I believe. All right. Peasants eat it to soothe pain. Erdelric tried it too, but only a few times. In larger doses, the mushroom causes visions, nightmares. Yes, the last thing Erdelric needed more of. Thanks for your help. Blood and marjoram. The taste of human flesh and a substance that triggers visions. That well could have caused the rage. Maybe even the transformation. Maybe. Hard to believe someone spiked the mead here in the hall, though, in front of all those witnesses. You're right. I helped prepare for the feast. I'd have noticed. It might have happened before they brought the drink upstairs. In the cellars, maybe? Come on. We could find some clues there. Follow Ceres to the cellar. Run, girl. We must find the traitors quickly. Elsewise, the warriors will take matters into their own hands. Castle's a buzz already. Think they'd attack Croc openly? My father or each other. All in the finest Skellige tradition. Haven't had a good civil war in ages. Knew there'd be trouble. It was all too calm. Funny. Arnvold said the same. For a feast to be any good, mead's gotta flow. But so does blood. Might say he got his wish. Mm. Lots of loots in here. And we gotta turn off the lights. It's important. Okay, maybe not that many. Uh, we won't go crazy going for the loots. Not this time. I really hope Yalmar's doing something useful, not just looking for a fight. Relax. Your brother's impetuous, not stupid. We keep the poison at the cellar's other end down below. Come, I'll show you. Oh, I'll pick up the loot if I'm already examining things. Is Evidence. The Hackerman spirit. Someone ruined several barrels of the finest. Good thing Dad's got other worries in his mind. Right behind you. That's a relief. Blood and mushrooms. Think we can find out where this barrel came from? Looks different. What the? That was quick. <gasps> Shit. Ooh, the I forgot about this. Play from the. We'll never move them. Don't intend to. Um. <laughs> she behind me? There she is. Follow Sarah through the tunnel. Go ahead, Sarah. We might have been burned alive. Somebody's damn desperate to bring our investigation to a quick end. Some freaking this sadist. One rarely used, more like. When Yalmar and I were little, we'd play here. Once. Ugh. Yeah, we're not walking like past that. A place of power. Sweet. Gain an ability point. And my quensine intensity increased. Hopefully, I use it before it runs out. That's usually how it goes. When I get my hands on that pyromaniac. Let's think. They had to use the entrance we used. Maybe they left some prints behind. Maybe. When the door slammed shut and the fire broke out, did you hear a bottle shatter too? No, <laughs> but I've no witcher senses at my disposal. You must hear the hair growing on my head. <laughs> I try not to eavesdrop. Anyway, yeah, and I both went checking. <laughs> Come on. at the same time. We're the same. Me and Geralt, we're the same. Always said it, and it proves true. Okay, sorry, sorry, no, we're not looting everything. Look for- oh, look for tracks around the cellar door. Okay, no, so we're not there yet, sorry. Someone walked through the mead. 
follow the footprints. I'm gonna have to grab one more thing, just one more. Trail breaks off. Need to find another clue nearby, something else to follow. Must have felt his clothing rip, but was That's lucky. What's That's this? really lucky. Piece of cloth. <laughs> it can't be. What is it? Their cornfold's tunic. Yeah, his tunic well, ripped off on cane. something. Sure about that? Saw him in the main hall with the servants. Let's go. Loot them all. I want to. I want the loots. Just feel like it takes up so much time. I don't need my Witcher senses activated Look, still. <gasps> Grab a horse, we'll chase him down. Horse time. Oh, I don't do well under pressure. <laughs> Iron Bolt! Stop, damn it! Doubt he'll listen. When I get my hands on him. Get out of the way! You don't stand a chance. We'll see you about that! Ooh. He's angry. Got him. Take it easy. We said shwap. Knock Why him off his horse. Him? Talk or I'll finish what I started. No on create should ever sit on Skellige's throne. Damn. I know you better than others do. You're hot-headed, irresponsible. Skellige needs stability. A strong king. Not the kind a band of drunken jarls will choose. Curious. Never heard you voice that idea, but I do know one who never stops saying it. It's Bernard Bran, isn't it? You were never a good liar, Arnvald. Let's find out what her motive is. What was her motive? It's obvious. She schemed this up to get rid of the other claimants. Slander our clan in the process. If she succeeded, Svanriga would have been left. The only claimant to Skellige's throne. We need proof. Your word against Berna's, that's not enough. Anvald, help us, and I'll ask my dad to grant you an honorable death. I'll insist. I have letters from her. Instructions. How to poison the mead. But she never signed them. There's no seal. Will that be enough? It'll have to be. We shouldn't delay. Time to gather the orals. Oh, the piece of fabric was big enough for her to recognize him. His whole sleeve. Yeah, I've super lucky. I've assembled the in council as you demanded, Saris on crate. You claim to know who's behind the slaughter at Kaer Trolda. Speak then. The blood of Skellige's sons and daughters. Whose hands does it stain? Bernard Brands. Bernard Bran. The lass is mad. Do you think anyone will believe you? You had them serve poison mead to the berserkers. I beg your pardon. The servants of Kaer Trolda are not mine to command. Twas your father who called for the feast, who assembled the guests. There's reason in these words. Have you any proof to confirm your accusation? I've better. I've a witness, Arnvald. Zerus speaks true. Burner commanded me to poison the maid. When Zerus and the Witcher descended into the cellars, you betrayed us. The clan that took you in. Good man. He's a servant to Ancreate, a lackey. He will say what they command him to say. He would lie for them even were he to pay for it with his head. Burner speaks true. Arnvald has served a care trolder ever since I remember. Noily, look a dog. I can vouch for Ceres. She's telling the truth. You? Yet another uncreate lackey? Did Ceres entice you to cooperate? I can imagine how. Or has Crack mm. paid you to smear my name? What did you say? Calm yourself. Get her, Crack. After what I saw on Speaker Rock, I trust the Witcher. More than I do you. You've that right. But it's no proof of my guilt. Got one more piece of evidence. A letter from Bernard to Arnvald, instructing him how to spike the mead. 
It lacks my signature. It lacks my seal. But perfume soaked through the parchment. A very strong scent, you know. Still to be sensed. <laughs> Is this your proof, lass? Is this what you call evidence of my supposed treason? Don't make me laugh. Burn is right, Saras. Tis all precious little proof of her wrongdoing. Alas, your brother Hjalmar also has not presented anything that could clear your family's name. We've but one path left to us. Holger, Lugos, it's time we quit this damn castle. Come, we must decide what punishment Clan on Crate will face. Just all the perfect answers. I know, she's got an answer for everything, doesn't she? I'm confused. Uh, we'll see what happens, I guess. I'm just... I hope I didn't miss something, and this is why it's not working out well. Something... I think something turns around here. I'm it's sorry, all gonna... Sirius. It's all gonna work out in a second, Wait. I think. Yes. Mother, you bid me to leave the hall before the feast. He doesn't have his mom's why? back. Son, not now. Why did you do it? How did you know? Hi! You stand silent. You gave Ceres no credence. Give the Witcher no credence. But you must give credence to a son who accuses his own mother. The massacre was her doing. She shamed herself. Me. The family. The clan. Svan Riga, I did it for you. Only for you. The bus is you going by and he pushes day. her right under it. Damn. As the eldest of the Jarls, I cleanse the name of Clan on Creep. And you, Berna Bran, I sentence to death. You will be chained to a rock to perish of hunger and thirst. And Ooh. sea fowl will peck apart your remains. That is a messed up thing. She did something very wrong. Damn, that would suck. Yeah, you don't have your mom's back, and then she is left to that fate. Which, yeah, she deserves it. But when I had a lust for power, I, knew I don't know this. if I would turn but my so mom in like that. <laughs> such a crime. What about Svanriga? What's his fate? He loses his home, his name, his honor. He'll choose exile or death. But enough. Whatever comes, we must endure. I thank you, Geralt. Again. No need. Again. I'll not take any more of this modesty. This is a land of heroes. Let this remind you of that. And now, I must ride for Gedinate, for the Jarl's council. Time to pick a king. What do you think? Who'll get the nod? Come with me. See for yourself. All may listen to our deliberations. Let's go. I do have a horse in the race. Can't refuse, to be honest. As I thought. Well, let's go. She didn't jump. She should have jumped. <laughs> like That would have probably been way better than the death that's awaiting her. You can actually go find her body. It's not part of a quest, like you're not directed or anything, time. but you can started. go find it somewhere. I think I stumbled upon it once by accident. We gave King Bran back to the sea. Today... Our morning ends. Today, by the grace of the gods and the clans, a new ruler takes the crown. Let us Woo. swear her fealty. Some would see another in my place. I thank those who stood at my side. Here, beneath the sacred oak, I pledge to be a good queen to the ones and the others. I want peace and prosperity to reign in Skellige. And I count on you to help me fulfill that dream.
Palkiosaurus. Oh, this is part of the Brothers in Arms quest. Congratulations. You'll make a great queen. Thank you. Wouldn't be here if it weren't for you. Got a delicate matter I wanted to bring up. Need your help. What is it? Cox mentioned Siri to you. He must have. Have you found him? Not yet, but I'm close. Problem is, as soon as I get to her, the wild hunt will probably be able to locate us quickly. So I'll want to take her to Care Morin. Battle the hunt there. I'm looking for allies. I can't leave the Earth's name. It's impossible. Shut down. What I can do is give you my best warrior, Yalmar. Think you'll be willing? I'm sure of it. In fact, I think I'll be overjoyed. Come on, you know him. Yeah, guess I do. Thanks. No doubt he'll be valiant. I hope he proves useful too. Good luck. Music got a little wonky there. I didn't even know this, damn. You go to care more and now. You alright? So so. Anyway you cut it, I was bested by a wench. Not just any wench. Die true. Suppose if it had to be so, I'm glad it was Ceres. The Wild Hunt's preparing to attack Kaer Morhen. Could use your help. Rates at the gate of your Witcher's stronghold. You're a friend of the clan. I cannot refuse you. What's more, no one crates ever stood and battled such a foe. I'll leave at once. Thanks. Won't forget this. Sweet. Oh my gosh. We can go right... I didn't realize we were that far along. We can go right... I, it makes sense, okay. It's been over a week since I last played. I forgot where we were, where we were at. We can go and get Siri now. Shit. Do I want to do that already? Wow. Um. Maybe I should do some side quests. I just don't, I don't want to start it and not finish it. Like, like when we get her, like when we head over there to get her. Uh, what else could I do right now? I mean, I've got a long list of things right here, but let's do this little quest, the fall of House Reardon. We gotta ask Dolores about the monsters in her manor. We could play some Gwent. Actually, I would love to play some Gwent. Right. Uh -oh. um, let's get the Gwent today. Unless somebody directly asks me <laughs> if I want to play Gwent. But otherwise, I'm just gonna do this quest. I don't think it takes that long. Um, so dark, I could barely see. We actually already came to this weird and manner for another quest. Yennefer and the Witchers managed to do it. The ugliest man alive revealed himself to be not man, but elf, hmm. and an elven sage at that. Have I'm just lot. wondering if this, this if I finish man. this quest very quickly, the hunt. then maybe and I'll just find another way. like side quest to do, and then, then in the next part we'll start out with. Um, Going to the Isle of Mists and getting Siri. Let's make it not the middle of the night. Or late at night. 11.30 p.m. is like middle of the night for me because I go to bed early. Good day. She didn't want to talk to me at first. What's become of me in my elder years? Refused a roof over me head by a common churl. I was born a noble's daughter. My brother and I, we managed the manor for years. What happened to him? A caller came one day. A drifter, a hunter. It wasn't long before we fell in love and wed. We prepared to leave the manor. My brother... That woman's been crying since January. <laughs> Years on, I returned, but found no sign of him. 
folk claimed monsters had infested our home. Come to nest there. I think I've been there. Don't need to worry about monsters anymore. I thank you. You don't know how much this means yeah. to me. I haven't the coin to reward you, but... Here, take this. It opens a chest. What's there is yours. What'll that leave you with? A roof over my head is all I need. And if it comes to it, I've other heirlooms to sell. But I know you witchers don't work for free. I could never let you go without honest pay. Gods keep you. Oh, well, we gotta go check out the thing there. Well, that was a really easy quest. Yeah, so if you've already gone to the place, which is here, um, yeah, I'm just gonna fast travel. If you've already gone, then I guess it changes things up, but if you haven't been there and you talk to her, then she sends you, and... I don't know what happens if you kill Letho, because this is where we found Letho. I don't know if... I don't know what happens if you killed Letho in The Witcher 2, but... I did not, so... That's who was here. No monsters. Yeah, let's find this chest she was talking about. Okay, it doesn't appear to be in here. Oh, that's a red door. Oh, oh we probably gotta... There we go. Well, now I gotta figure out another another side quest to do. Why was that door red? Oh, there's a ladder right here. Am I on the correct side? This is a stable. There's something up there, but it's yellow. I guess we can try to get up there. Oop. I don't know how we would get up there. I'm not worried about it. You know what? I'd be shocked if that was the chest. It's locked. Okay, we unlocked it. Somebody lived here once. Seems a bit more promising. Ooh. Hmm, something here. A chest. Mm. Mm. Dolores. Oh, okay. I think that's it. I'll just peek over here just in case. Okay, that's all. That is it for this one. Well, that was long and eventful. Okay. Maybe we should do some fist fighting? Would that be fun? I don't know. We could do Gwent. Let's do Gwent. There he is. Oh, I think I needed to talk to him for another quest. We know each other? Not personal, like. Though I've seen ye many times. I have a gift. I see the future. Yours as well. But not for free, I guess. I don't ask much. If you've a bite to eat. Here, let's do this and then... Here. Thank ye. A fine and offering. What? Well worth a foretelling. <sighs> Alright, let's hear it. I see a white wolf. He looks on as the great viper bites and devours the silver lily. He wants to spring. He wants to fight. But the serpent Great is Great viper bites the and devours the sil sil perish. silver lily. That's Letho. That's not the future. Lived through that. School of the viper. Silver lily is Foltest. Letho killed King Foltest in The Witcher 2. The older I become, 
But if you bought me some dragon's root... Rare plant. Rare indeed. But it did once grow in a cave southeast of here. Fine. I'll see what I can do. Alright, let's go get him... That route that he wants. Can I fast travel? No, I cannot. Um, and then we'll play him in one. Considering turning on enemy scaling. All these side quests that I put off doing and then I sometimes go back to. Dragon's root. Got it. Whatever can really help the old man see the future. Did I miss anything else in here? Something about a tree growing in a cave just looks so fascinating. For some reason. We got so many mushrooms now, I've been in plenty of caves. that? Oh, it's a little bunny! See the bunny? The snow hair! Look how close it lets you get to it. In real life, bunnies, they're so fast, they do not let you get close. Oh, there's more. These ones are brown. But they're still cute. Mm, there's a bear. That bear is not as cute. Actually, bears are pretty cute. They're just scary. I'll try to ignore it so we don't have to kill it. Because if it attacks me, then... I mean, I gotta kill it then. The black is no at all. Okay, let's start sprinting and get to the... Soothsayer faster. Oh, you're back. They lick blood bunnies? That's gross. Got what you asked for. Blood lookers. Seggy. Now I need a moment. He needs a moment. <laughs> what did he just go in there and do? I see a wolf striving forward towards a solitary tower midst a blizzard. He follows a swallow, yet the swallow does not heed the wolf's howls, soaring higher and higher, for it knows tis its last flight. As do others say, so shall it be. Look for the signs. The world will perish amidst ice and be reborn with the new sun. Reborn of the elder blood of Hen Iker of a planted seed. If Ling's prophecy. Leave me be. No. Go. No. Go now. I would have played Gwent with you first if I knew you were going to say to leave you be. Although maybe. Oh no. Oh no, he's still there. We're good, we're You're good. Back. There was once news about flesh eating bunnies. Ew. Wanted to ask you. Those damn I, bunnies. I play Gwent. And I, we can play for the prize card in my collection. You a mind reader? The good gods did bless me with some precognition. I say some, because it's selective like, when they applies to mundane matters. I've got Not that a too. A bird will have a shit on me, but all my foresights never helped me win at Gwent. Let's lay him out. I'm not using the Squirtle deck. I don't think I even can. 
All right. Oh no. Oh, I hate a monster deck, but you'll definitely want a Biting Frost for that. I don't think we're gonna need all these though. A spy would be nice. Got a plan here. See what they do. Fast? Damn it. Why'd you decoy that? I've got a plan. It's not a foolproof plan, but yes. Oh. Oh, okay. I was going to use my Biting Frost to lower all their close combat cards down to one. I didn't even need to do that. Now, ugh, now I've got all these close combat ones. I mean, it's fine because I won the first round. I'm surprised they passed. Let's see how this goes. Ooh, nice, a spy. And they used a decoy card. Hopefully they don't have another. <gasps> and I got a Scorch. That should be good. Maybe. Effectively use that scorch just yet. No, I really can't use it. Oh, now I can. Let's see. I have to use my medic. I don't want to use the other, the blue stripes guys. Um. Yeah, go for that. That's fine. So I got full test. That can clear that shit right up. Mm. Should I use my Scorch now, or...? I don't know. I can just use this to get it out of the way. Well, no, then the Scorch won't really help out that much. Well... No, yeah, I think it's fine. And then I can clear it when I need to. Ooh. Okay, I think now would be a good time to use it. Actually, maybe... No, yep, yeah, now would probably be, probably be the best time. Nice. Oof. That's a lot. They passed, okay. Made it way more simple for me. Didn't even need to use my full test card. So is the Seussail's lot. Yay! Know where to find the finest slippery jacks this fall, but how to play and not lose, that I'll never know. A beautiful win. Take this card, you deserve it. Know of any others who play Gwent? You? 
You've bet one I get. opponent worth your while in Velen, in the village of Midcops. They calls him Haddy. He's a tyke, barely a handful of summers to him, but don't let that fool ye. Oh, I got a monster. He had a monster deck. I got a monster card, which I don't want because I want more Northern Realms cards. So that's all I can even use right now. Um, no, I'll do it with you another time. Build your boats in Pinewood? Of course not. Wench tracked me some pints so I'd make her a cradle. Boat business not booming? Not well at all. Ain't no fish. Heard you're a good boat right. And an even better card player. You wanna play? Hell yeah. Always ready for a round. This is the new card that I got. Weavis. Alright, he's got a Nilfgaard deck. It's not bad, not bad. Okay. Full test, or do I want to just throw another card down? I'm gonna use full test. Oop. All right. Nice. I got another card. That's sweet. from your enemy's discard pile. That sucks. Got two lodge members in the ranged combat room. Playing my Siegfried against me. I think I didn't take the Crinfree Reaver from me. I really hope he doesn't use a Torrential Rain now. Hopefully I didn't have more than one. Want to give him another five points? Who is that? Mortison? No idea who that is. Um, my dandelion will give me an extra nine points. He still has three cards. This is risky. 
what two cards am I gonna get? Yeah, not very good. Ugh. At least that will give me some more cards. A Sierra. I can't use that impenetrable fog. That's what I meant to say earlier when I said torrential rain. I was gonna use. Oh! I thought he would use. Um... I can't remember his name. Uh, I'm gonna pass. So I can't lower the range combat that low because that would screw me way worse. Oh goodness. He's got one card. Please don't be a siege. Oh, nice. Oh wait, no, now he's got two more. Crap. Shoot. What's that last card gonna be? <gasps> oh no. We tied. Wait, how'd they win the round? We tied. I'm confused. Um, okay, well this is gonna be a tie game. What? How? Nilfgaard something. Okay, it's considered a defeat. So round two and round three, we both have the same amount of points, but they won. Ye lost, but you need no, I didn't lose. Punch. Round here, they say bad luck at cards means good luck at love. Proven true. Shut up. We're you doing this again. Up for a round. Why not? Always. Man, well traveled. So tell yeah, me. That was unexpected because it was stupid. They didn't win though. That's the thing. We have the same exact amount of points in two rounds. And then some goofy rule. I mean, I talk shit on that rule, but I like the rule when it gives me an extra card. Uh, Stennis. That's his name I couldn't think of. I hate this Stennis card because it gives him five points. Like, Deekstra only gives four points. I think Taller gives two points. Um, yeah, let's do this. I'm good with it. That's actually, I actually kind of like how they did that lore-wise, that like, when Nilfgaard comes to a, like when the, when the Nilfgaardian deck basically comes like a stalemate or a tie, technically they win. There's like this weird little like Nilfgaard faction thing that's, that can be triggered that basically means they win because in the second war against Nilfgaard, they lost, but they technically, they technically lost, but they kind of won when it came to... It's a whole thing. But <laughs> they they actually um, had the upper hand in, like, trade and world affairs after, after the war. So I feel like it's fitting. Yeah, see that faction ability that was triggered? That's what like, gave me an extra card. I love that. But when it's them getting to claim victory during a draw, I don't like it. Um, yeah, let's just start throwing them down. Doesn't really matter too much where we start. But you always want to try to start low in case they have a Scorch. The Scorch is scary. Maybe not pile. Oh no! Took one of my dead cards. Maybe not pile too many on one row immediately.
Well, we can remove the biting frost. Let's see if we even need to, though. We might need to. Damn. Scorch is what scares me. All right, what are they all worth? Five, 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 six, so 15, 21, and then 14. Okay, so what we're gonna do is double this up. Still losing, but let's see what happens. How many points do I get? Ooh, hell yeah! <laughs> Some basic math could help you, but I don't remember what all the cards' original worth is, especially Ooh, theirs. The card's mine. Yeah, Oi, give me that card. Indeed. Cards. Believe you're good enough to try your luck against Hattie. Folk laugh at him because he's young and a bit dim, but word is, he weren't afraid to beat the Baron himself. Cool. We got Letho of Gullet. Let's take a look. Oops, wrong menu. Uh, Gwentek. We can only I think we can only use it in the Nilf card. Yeah. But he looks pretty oops. He looks pretty badass. Not affected by any special cards or abilities, yeah. He's got the gold thing around him. Throw him in the deck. Still can't use it though. Yeah, I want some more Northern Realms. Maybe that's what we'll get from Hattie, we'll see. Yeah, he gave that card. He handed it right over, because he knew. We knew I beat him up. Just kidding. All right, I think that's where we're going to leave off for today. But tomorrow when we pick up... All these side quests are really small, I believe. I'll, I'll be sure of that before I dive in. I'll check that out offline. But, because when you do what we're going to do tomorrow, Isle of Mists, we go to Skellige, and then we go to seek out Ciri. And it's super exciting, and I'm really happy we're doing that. Um, but when you go to the Isle of Mists, that's when you enter a point in the game where you will lose some side quests. For example, the quest, the Return to Crookback Bog quest, where you help the Baron find his wife, or rescue his wife from the Crones. If you haven't done that one, by the time you do this, um, there's a name I can't think of, so I, I'm just over describing, but <laughs> you get it. You can't do that quest where it automatically fails. And I don't think there are any more quests that I haven't done that are going to fail. So I think we're good to just kick off with this one tomorrow. I'll probably fast travel over to Skellige and then we'll go from there. So that's exciting. I'm going to possibly, who knows, see Siri. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much for watching. I hope you are having a wonderful week. I hope you continue, continue to have a wonderful week. And I hope I see you in the next one. Bye.